listen to this. Do you Bible understand? Study, he that is he, of God. Lawson, he is of God. Come on. Hear God's word. You want to hear God's word. If you have God, you want to hear God's word. Come on. Ye therefore hear them not. Ye therefore hear them not. Come on. Because ye are not of God. Because ye are not of God. You're going to find a lot of people, Hebrews 12 and 4, you're going to find a lot of people, they're not of the Most High. They're not of the Most High. Their job, just like we have a job. Our job is to teach you the word of the Heavenly Father. To bring you back to your true nationality. To bring you back to righteousness. But then you have demons. You have witches. Their job is to keep you in this current world. To keep you lost. To keep you in darkness. That's their job. Their job is to keep you lost in an in in American source. That's their job. You understand? That's what you saw what he did. He came. He's hugging the guys over there. Seducing them or whatever he was saying. He surely wasn't coming out the Bible. We're coming out the Bible. But he surely wasn't coming out the Bible. His job is to... Get you back into the cycle. Get you back in the rat race. Get you back into the, 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 the lies that this country has been teaching for over a thousand years. That's his job. But you know, you know what happens? When you read the Bible, the Bible is powerful, man. It cuts right into your, your through your flesh, into your soul, and reveal your intent. I'm going to read that to you now. Read that. Hebrews, Hebrews 12 and 4. Hebrews 12, chapter 4, verse. You know what I'm saying? Hebrews 12, verse 4. Come on. Ye have not yet resisted unto blood. We, Lord said, we have not yet resisted unto blood. You guys want some literature? I got some literature if you want some literature. Okay. You have a question? I can answer your question. Again. No? Try 4 and 12. About the two edged sword? Is that, is that 20 and 12 and 4? Y'all read 12 and 4. Alright, go to 4 and 12. You guys have any questions, by the way? You guys have any questions? I don't. I just, I've read the Bible. I'm not, you know, I'm South American and Asian. And Where's I'm your father? I'm sorry? Where's your father? He's Japanese. And you? Okay. But he doesn't yeah, know. He's just listening. Yeah, I wanted good. to listen because I've seen many of these groups in San Francisco and not seeing other people, but I've in heard the Bay that Area? you guys, I, I see that you guys are, you know, just preaching, I mean, reading from the Bible, so I wanted to listen to what you guys are saying. You see us, guys that's like us teaching the same thing in San Francisco? Yeah. In the Bay Area? I don't know exactly. I've seen it on YouTube. Uh, I don't know if it's actually. No, no, I got some uh, regular books. I talk with them on the phone. Uh, you see? That's uh, okay. Well, the teaching is the truth. You're going to find, like, like the, this, this, uh, the Dominican brother said, so called Dominican brother said, the Lord is not about religion. He's about the Word of God. You understand? But the problem is, a lot of people, are, they're not following the Word of God. They're not following the Word of God. So, what I don't I have a question. So, last time I was here, I listened for like a few hours, and then I said, could I come to your temple or whatatever it's gone? Right. And he said, no, because I'm not. White. The nationality. Right. What we gather. Right. That's what I don't get. Like, well, first of all, why do you guys preach here? If like ninety percent of the people who walk by can't even, you know, they're not even interested. Mm -hmm. And secondly, ninety percent of the people what? They walk by. A lot, a lot of the people who walk by, even not just white people, Africans, all sorts of people you don't believe are, are you know, eligible to. Uh, Zephaniah two one. And, well, the Lord. Well, when you read the Bible, the Lord told us to come out here on the highways and byways and gather our people. But what's the point? When you read the yeah, yeah. when you read the Bible, we know. Like I said earlier, you heard I said it uh, numerous times. We know all of our people are not going to uh, listen to this. But I am. But I, you're saying that's good. I can. We're, we're not saying you should. You're saying I can listen, but what's I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. I'm gonna show you. Why can't I do any guys? Because I'm gonna show you why. You understand? Read that real quick. Zephaniah two verse one. Gather yourselves together. The Lord said, gather yourselves. He said, you Jews, right. gather yourselves together. Come on. Yeah, right. gather together. Come on. All nation, all nation, not desire. All nation is single. There's no S at the end of this nation. All nation, not desire. So the Lord is telling a nation. Uh, he's, he's telling a nation that's not desire. What about it? To gather together. But now, go, go, hold that and go to Jeremiah what 16 about like, like, like the story? But now, as far as, far as you... Know, like in the Bible, like, like in the story of like Noah, right? Like he's not just talking to other Jews. It's talking about the whole world, right? Okay. So like, we, we preach to the whole world. I'm not, I, 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 I think I told you. you I, remember, I remember you. you were like, oh, I think he was in your, out here on two occasions, if I remember. Maybe. You know? But we, the, the Lord said we would be like a light to the world. Lots right. of white people have come in and said we're teaching the truth. Right. And they're taking out notes and literature. Right, but then you still think I'm like, what, the devil? Right, or but I'm not, and I, and you are. But, but at the but, same time, I'm not going to stop you from listening to the Bible. I'm not going to stop you. But like, what's the, like, for example, she's not. Get, like, why are you answering my questions, though? Like, because that's you know, my job. That's my job. It's, I'm tell, I, I, the Bible didn't say not to teach you. It said, it said to teach you the truth. 
You might not like it. Read that. I'm going to show you. Jeremiah, look up here. I'm going to show you. Look up here. Read that. Jeremiah 16. The Bible says, I got to tell you the truth. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm not going to just say you're the devil and just leave it at that. I'm going to show you why you're the devil and why you did it. The truth. Once I've accepted I'm the devil, what do I Read do? Read the Bible and live a righteous lifestyle. Can I and then wait for judgment. But am I still the devil? Yeah, you're still the devil. You are, you are who you are. You understand? Read the Bible. Check out what the Lord said here. Read that. Jeremiah 16, verse 9. 19. 16, 19. Awesome. Oh, Lord, my strength and my fortress. Lord, he's our strength and our fortress. You understand? We don't look to America and the things of America to protect us and to stabilize us. The Bible's our fortress and our protection. Come on. And my refuge. And our refuge. Come on. In the day of affliction. In the day of affliction. We're in the day of affliction. We're in a day where hard times are hitting us heavy. We're being killed every day. We're, in, we're surrounded by danger and temptation. All right. But we know. Let me finish this. It's going to get to your part soon. You know. But we know as long as we stay in the Bible, that's our, that's our fortress. That's our protection. That's our stability. Come on. The details shall come. Unto thee. See? And you're the Gentile. The Gentiles are non Jew. The Lord said, The Gentiles shall come to us. Come on. Unto thee. Come on. From the ends of the earth. From the ends of the earth. All over the world they're going to come to us. Come on. And shall say. And they're going to say to us. Come on. Surely our fathers. Surely your fathers. You're going to say in your mind and to us or other heathens or white people or Chinese or Japanese or Filipinos. Right. They're going to come to us and they're going to say, Surely our fathers. Come on. Have inherited love. Have inherited or taken all lives. You see? Now let me ask you a question. Were you wait, ever? But wait, what's it say after that, though? Like, what's the point of that? Like, so once they the point say that, is, they turn to God. The, the, right? the point, the point. You, you can turn to God, but you gonna but turn to God. But, but you gonna turn. The, so let me ask you a question. Let me ask you a question. Yeah, me, it's a wall, eh? Yeah, the wall. How's is, there a wall? The wall? The wall is that once I once I say I accept what you're teaching and everything. Right. You don't have any answer for what I should do after. I, 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 I don't have an answer. Repent. Yeah, but I want to go to your. No, you can't do that. You can't do that. Cause we're a whole. Give me do the only seventy six. I gotta go in a minute. But. <laughs> you just bring out one thing. Jeremiah, um, Lamentation five and seven. You gotta understand, like the brother brought to you, just because you accept the truth, right? right? That don't mean that you don't have a penalty to pay now. Right. You still got a penalty to pay. Let me show you something. Why do I? Lamentation 5 and 7. I want to know now. I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you something. Lamentation 5 and 7. I'm going to show you something in the Bible. There's still a penalty. Read. Lamentation 5, verse 7. Our fathers have sinned. Our fathers sinned in the past. Come on. And are not. And are not. Come on. And we have born. Their iniquities. So we had to feel what our fathers, because of what our fathers did, we had to mourn. We had to suffer for the sins of our fathers. You see? Now go to Isaiah 14 and 21. So now let's get you now. So it's just fair. It's even Stephen. Because in the last days, a lot of so-called white people is going to admit the wrong that they have done. And they're going to want to apologize. But it ain't going to just go down like that now. You see what I'm saying? You still got to suffer. Now, you may have some idiots that call themselves elders, GMS, that probably would say you're an Israelite and accept you, but we're not 